it's a movie that it's a moral that it tells you don't like you don't just break up your friend something like something stupid and it's about when these two little girls they did like something wrong that's when at the end like they be friends again and the moral the whole movie is like just telling you don't you break up with someone that you still have feelings about for no reason okay is it based on anything that happened or that you witnessed? It's kind of something like that, but I ain't gonna name no names. Okay. Because the movie is about, it's like based on a true story, and I want to get people that experienced it, not people that just acted out and they a good act. I want to get people that really experienced it, and they understand what's it about. So that's why I want to get people that's experienced it and not just like someone that just acted it up. I don't. I like to get people that's experienced. You gotta be experienced to be with this person. Like this, you gotta be experienced, okay? I'm saying like it's about these two little girls. They are the two people that's gonna be like. You're really gonna be seeing them in the movies and that. That's when somebody's gonna tell their point of view and somebody in the middle of it that's trying to like tell, get them together. Like it's like, I think I should do three girls. And one in the middle is gonna be in the middle of all of it and she don't have nothing to do with none of it. That's what I wanna do, okay? Mm -hmm. And she should put them together and they tell their point of view and she just tell them you have to be friends and you're just doing this for no apparent reason. And it's gonna be somebody gonna affect them, like someone that like someone they don't like, the people don't like. And that's it. Like, you know I'm, hey, I'm very excited about this because my only why baby um, I can do something that I love to do, not because nobody wants me to do it. I like to act. I like to direct. Because I'm one of a kind. I'm one of a kind. So nobody really inspired me because it's just me. I'm the only one. It's me, it's me. See? So. My next one, I'm not really thinking about that one because I think it's going to be like a comedy. Where people can just laugh and enjoy that stuff. This one is going to have your heart broken and like you want to see more about it, so that's why. Uh -huh. I have auditions and I want to ask the people who are in the audition, did you put in the, like, will you like this? Did you experience this? Cause like I said, I don't want nobody to be in a position like they don't want, they feel awkward with. Like, you just can't put somebody in one position and say, just act this out. It's not like that. You gotta have somebody that's experienced. That's what I'm saying. Okay. So, now I just wanna say this. To any of you actors that experience this, can you please come auditions, please? Because I would like to get people that was in this situation. So please, please, please come to the auditions. I just want to say that I think Jamari's idea is very good, and I think he he has a good he has a good thinking, and I think it's going to be a great movie. Yeah. Plan on acting in it if he put me in it, but overall I just give good I just give a good job, Jamari, because one person cannot just make up a whole movie by himself. But he can, and he is a very good director. I think he he's gonna be a director when he grows up. So kudos to him. Yeah, I will be I will be in the film industry because it's not that I want to do it. Is that it like inspires me? And one and one director that inspires me is Spike Lee because he he's a very good director and he films a lot of movies and I plan to be a film director when I grow up. Uh -huh. So you like Spike Lee's movies, huh? Uh -huh. Uh -huh.
Mm-hmm. But wait, yeah. Spike Lee, don't you know the movie? Did you ever see the movie, um, Do the Right Thing? Did you like it? Well, you I, didn't? No, I can really see it. Okay. okay, what didn't you like about it? I didn't see it. That's oh, you didn't I, see I, it? I was about saw the trailer. Oh. Uh. Have you seen another one of Spike Lee's movies? Either one of you? No. I did. I think I saw the one with Michael X. Michael X. Oh. And he was saying, when Denzel, when Denzel Washington, Michael X. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What about you, sweetheart? Any other movies you've seen that no, you've I haven't seen, seen a lot. Oh. Well, how do you know he's a good director? Because. Because I know he's a good director because he comes to a lot of the basketball games and he introduces himself to say he's a good director. Ah. No, okay. you, he's a, I'll, he's a, he's like a very good New York Knicks fan and I see him, I see him like every Knicks game, so I just know that. And he, he, he says he's a good director, but I haven't seen a lot of his movies. And if you don't, and if you don't have the um, acting experience, like you don't feel like acting is your type, just please just come here. I'll just help you tell you they'll help you. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's excellent. Thank you so much, gentlemen. I'm looking forward thank to you. seeing your you film. You're a legendary. You. Thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. You've given us this opportunity. <laughs> Yes, and I'm just so happy hey, somebody have something, somebody like you to be right by their side. And you are a good role model for all this And I hope you stay. Thank you. And what should we say? Um, and cut. And cut. cut.